Welcome to Anexon Air. I'm Bart Woodley, one of the Senior Solution Architects here at Anexon. Today's topic is on Suite Analytics and the new multi-joint feature. As mentioned, the Suite Analytics multi-joint feature is one of the newer functions brought into the core of NetSuite. As you can see on the screen, I have a number of data sets that are already part of this demo account. Specifically today, we're going to work through the transaction, vendor and customer data set that I've already put time in creating for the demo today. If I scroll across to my workbooks, you can see I have a number of different workbooks pre-created in this demo account. But utilizing the multi-joints, what I want to do is bring these workbooks together so I don't have to click in and out of different workbooks to get the data that I require. For my example today, I'm going to look at a basic example of bringing together customer and vendor data. As you can see, I've got two basic tabs. One is looking at my top five vendors and one is looking at my top five customers. Bringing together the multi-join, it's allowed me to join three data sets, one being the customer, two being the vendor, and three being the transactions, to basically give me access to all data across those three data sets within one workbook. What I'm showing you here is where NetSuite is essentially automatically doing the join between the transaction and the vendor data sets, so I don't need to understand what the primary and secondary keys are within the linking of the multi-join. This is making it easy for me to simply select my data sets and bring together one workbook outlining data against customers and suppliers. Thanks for watching Anexa on Air and stay tuned for our next episode.